uh, oscillator that gives output without any input. Now here we are going to see how to design it. In order to, in order to design that one, first we need a BJT to get the BJ and also that uh, BJT is NPN, um, yeah NPN BJT. And if you look at uh, there are PNP and NPN BJT ready available in LT Spice. You have to just look for it and get. And here this is the one I'm choosing. And the model I want is BC547B. So I click this one and then. I go to the models and then B uh, here I can pick whatever the model I want. I want the BC 547B that is right here. Click OK and I want to zoom out a little bit. OK, so now we can add our resistors, inductance, capacitor and all the stuff. Let's go and see. So first uh, I'm adding the cut resistors for this we will have a resistor here 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 and uh, that is it we need four resistors and then we need some capacitors click this one and then i need a capacitor here and then one here and two here connected like this and uh, that is it so totally we need uh, four capacitors and then we need an inductor inductance that is connected like this once we have all this we can start wiring them and connecting them together so click this one to wire and i want to connect like this Okay, and these two resistors connected with this. F3. Okay, and these two resistors connected like this. And also make sure this is touching this wire, so I want to cancel and touch that one first because when I touch, I see I should see a knot. Like this. Okay. And one, uh, we grab a wire from here. Okay, and uh, this one goes right here okay and uh, that is basically it and we can start grounding some of the stuff click the ground connect one here and i need one here and i i need i'm going to need one here and this one connected directly with this and this one connected in between the capacitors and here need a, we need a voltage source but uh, the voltage source we are going to use is this one CL this voltage right here and you can flip this one by clicking control plus R and uh, that will flip the voltage source put the one here and then make a connection <coughs> okay that is the circuit now we have to just put the values 
and also I need, I'm missing a connection here okay let's put the values right click this one uh, for this one I want to put 0 0.1 micro farad so 0 0.1 for the micro we just put you and it will turn into micro and then uh, this resistor 40k ohm resistance 47k and this one on the bottom is 10k ohm resistance Ten K, and this one right here is forty four seventy, and this one right here is two point two K, and this capacitor is zero point one microfarad, and this capacitance right here is fifty point seven nanofarad. And this one right here is also 50.7. And this inductance, I'm going to give you 0.1 milli. Okay, and also the voltage source, we put like 10 voltage. Okay, seems like all the values entered, nothing missing. Now we are ready to test. So let's go ahead and run the simulation run and uh, here i'm just going to give 10 millisecond for the millisecond for the stop time and then click ok and we are ready to check it now in order to check the output we click about the inductance over here uh, that is going to give the output okay something wrong let me erase this Let's see if I'm missing anything. 47k, 2.2k, and I'm not missing any connection. 10k, 470, 0 0.1 microfarad, and this one is over here. And two, two, two. Okay, and this one is grounded like this. And yeah, this one should be nano here. I missed the nano part. Okay, let me close this. okay so let's go ahead and run again uh, let's check it now now you can see this is the output we supposed to get and this is the behavior of the LC oscillator like uh, this one has an output without any input and if you want to see the XX output like how it's look like you can zoom it out by selecting a certain area and the area is going to look like this you can also select a very few area so you will have the clear viewers view of the continuous output we are getting and that is it for this video i hope you guys found it really helpful thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe my channel see you guys in my next video